Hey guys, how's it going? Thanks for stopping by. So for today, we're doing a vegan taste test and I think you're gonna like it. I think we're good. Ready? Let's do it. Guys, I am so hungry. This smells phenomenal. It it smells out of this world, guys. All right. No talking. I'm diving in. Cheers. Oh my God, this is so good guys. This is incredible. So this is what I would do differently. I'd put these in an air fryer so they get a little bit more crispy. And then I'll heat up the sauce and then I, I pour it over. So these are nice and crispy. You know what this is missing? This is missing rice. Um, and you know, those baby, those baby corns, you know what this reminds me of? I'm gonna tell you exactly what this reminds me of. It reminds me of Yard House uh, Garden Orange Chicken. That's what this reminds me of. It is so good guys. It's not exactly like it, right? But this, if you're craving uh, yard house and they're closed or whatever, if you have like a bag or two of these at home, just make some white rice with it, throw in whatever vegetables you want in the mix guys, and you're set, you're absolutely set. Like I said, the only thing I would change about this is the, I would make the texture a little bit more crispy. And you could do that by putting in an air fryer and then you're all set guys. Speaking of yard house, I want to talk to you guys. Um, I want to talk to you guys about something really, really quick that happened. Uh, this was about a week ago. So my husband and I took out his sister. She's here from Romania. We went to yard house and you know what? I order the usual. I always order the guardian orange chicken. Anyways, it comes with the rice. So I'm starving and I, I just dive in and usually I inhale it like I'm good. There's no break in between. There's no break in between. Anyways, I'm tasting the rice and I'm like, man, something's off. So I push it off to the side, I wait a little bit, you know, I, I just kind of, I felt nauseous all of a sudden for some reason. Okay, it passed. I went back in, I started eating again. I feel a little bit, I feel a little bit nauseous and I'm like, what the hell? So I give it a second. I'm thinking it's something I ate before. I, I have no idea. So every time I'm diving back in, this nausea comes back and I'm like, something's up with this rice. There, there's, this rice is different now. There's something wrong with it. So I called the waiter over and I'm like, can I ask you a question? He goes, yes. I said, did they put butter in this rice? And he says, yes. And I'm like, okay. 
I haven't had, but well, I've been vegan, what, over 10 years now. I don't have the enzymes for it. Guys, I felt awful for two days. For two days, I felt bad. And I'm like, did they, and I asked them, I said, when did they start doing this? Because I had it about two weeks before and the rice wasn't like this. He says they recently started doing that. So I'm just telling you right now, guys, be aware if you order any kind of like jasmine rice over at Yard House, make sure they don't they don't put any butter in it. And I'm not sure if it's like a pre-made batch that they're doing now. I'm not really certain, but just so you know. Anyways, this reminds me a lot like it, guys. This is phenomenal. Uh, on my way back from work, I'm gonna pick up a few and put it in the freezer because, I mean, if you want that orange chicken garden, you got it right here. So good, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed this video. Take care, God bless. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna finish this. I'm so hungry. Take care, God bless, and I'll see you in the next one.